If you guys want cheap and reliable GTA Cash services for Xbox, PS4, and PC, make sure you guys go check out their mods for modded accounts. They have the safest methods on buying GTA 5 accounts and also the fastest delivery times with thousands of happy customers. So if you guys want GTA services, make sure you guys go check out their mods. Yo, what is up guys? Tom's on here back again with a new video. On today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to get these dope outfits in GTA 5 Online. So if you guys want to know how to get these outfits in GTA 5 Online, all you guys got to do is say to the end of the video to know how to do this easy glitch in GTA 5 Online. Online. Now guys, before today's video starts, if this glitch does work for you, I'll appreciate if you drop a like and subscribe and notifications on for more videos like this, such as money glitch videos and mod outfit videos just like this. And also guys, make sure you guys go in the comment section, comment that the glitch did work for you so that people who try this glitch will know it's going to work and they can also get these outfits. And yeah guys, let's get into the video. Now guys, keep in mind when doing the transfer glitch, you guys will be losing all your outfits except one, okay? So I'm going to be showing you guys my outfits right, right now. So when I come over to clothing and come over to my saved outfits, I only have have one outfit that I'm gonna be I only have okay so for me I'm not gonna be losing no outfits okay but for you all you want to do is equip an outfit that you do not want to lose okay so all you guys want to do is equip the outfit you do not want to lose so for me I do not want to lose this one so I'm gonna equip it now once you have an outfit you do not want to lose come over to online and head over to swap character and also guys I try my best to make this video as short as possible so I try making it like lower than 20 minutes okay now once you guys are in the swap character, all you guys want to do now is come over to your second um, slot. Now guys, if your main character is not on the second slot, which is the, I mean, first slot, which is the one with the green joggers, if your main character is not on it, just back out this video because the glitch will not work, okay? But if your character is on the same slot as mine with the green joggers, all you want to do is go over to the second slot and make a new character, okay? And if you guys do get that alert saying like the level rank 120, just accept it. You get a free high-end department, also your rank is automatically level 120, okay? Now you guys want to do is change the gender to a female and then just name it whatever then save and continue okay don't worry how the character looks like because you're going to be deleting her later on the glitch now once you guys load into the game all you guys want to do is um pull up the map and check if the clothing store icons are showing on the map okay because if they are not showing as you guys can see for me they are not showing all you want to do is go over to online and do find a new session but if your clothing store icons are showing for you on the map all you guys want to do is just head over to it All you want to do now is just head over to the clone store when you do load into the new session and i'm gonna be making the outfits and be right back when i have all of them finished so i can make the video shorter as short as possible so we go got the four outfits done now guys these are the outfits these are how they look like okay so basically these are the components if this is your first time ever doing transfer glitch okay so these outfits will get you the modern outfits okay so the first one i'm sure you guys how to make is the juggernaut outfit so all you want to do now is come over to biker cuts and purchase the patch darter vest which is on number 50 okay once you have this on all you want to do now is come over to tucked t-shirts up here so there you go tucked t-shirts right here and all you guys want to do now is purchase the black roll t number four on tucked t-shirts okay so once you have the tucked t-shirt on all you guys want to do now is come over to the pants section right here so once you are on here Come over to sport pants, I mean, not sport pants, jeans, and put on the black cropped jeans number 38, okay? Once you have these on, all you want to do is come over to the shoes right here, and put on, co come over to boots, and purchase the Ash Monster boots number 77. This is how they look like, so make sure you purchase those. And once you have that, you will need two more things, okay? So come over to the glasses right here, and all you guys want to do now is purchase, um, come over to casual glasses, and purchase the copper marbles number 22. Now that you guys are got the glasses, all you want to do is purchase the last thing, which is the hat. Now the hat will get you the checkerboard um hat, okay? The bucket hat, okay? So all you want to do now is come with the canvas hat and put on the gray plate canvas hat number 78. And once you have that, all you guys want to do now is head over to the cashier and save the outfit, okay? Now guys, I would I would recommend to save it the same way I type it in. So when I'm merging the outfit, so you guys won't get confused on making them, okay? So all you guys want to do now is, uh, once you have saved it, is I'm showing you guys on how to make the second outfit, which is this one right here. So all you guys want to do now is come over to work jackets and purchase the dark wooden closed field, which is number 7, okay? So, and also guys, if your thing is open, just come over to styles and go all the way to the bottom where it says jacket, and then it's going to say an option like open and close, okay? So just make it closed if your thing's open already, okay? Now once you have closed it, all you guys want to do now is come over back to the tops. And then all you guys want to do now is come over to um, gun running t-shirts. And all you guys want to do now is purchase the gray digital roll T number 19. <coughs> Once you guys have it, all you guys want to do now is come over to the pants right here. 
Well, you should already have the pants, so I'm not gonna be showing you guys how to get them, okay? So I guess we do not come over to the shoes right here. Come over to the shoes, and all you guys want to do now is come to high heel boots and purchase the deluxe midnight combats number 24, okay? So once you guys got the boots, all you guys want to do now is come over to the um gloves right here, not the gloves, the accessories, and come over to gloves and now purchase the light wooden tacticals number four, okay? Once you guys got the um gloves on, all you guys want to do now is head over to the cashier and save this outfit. So once you guys have saved it, I'm sure you guys have to make the set the third outfit. The third outfit has two components to it, okay? So it has this one and the second outfit. And also, guys, when you're saving them, make sure you guys leave spaces between the outfits, okay? Except this out, these two outfits, these you gotta save right right next to each other, okay? Now the next outfit I'm showing you guys is this one right here. All you guys want to do is come over to uh, sport jackets and purchase the sea green puffer jacket number 99. And all you guys want to do is come over to the busters right here. And all you guys want to do is purchase the white lace buster number 17. Once you guys have the white lace buster, all you guys want to do now is come over to the um the shoe. I mean not shoes, the pants. And all you guys want to do is come over to sport pants and put on the spotted muscle pants number two. I mean not number two, number one I meant. Um, all you guys want to do now is come over to the shoes, and all you guys want to do, do now is come over to purchase the black slack boots. And I guess for some reason they're on number 33 first, but when you purchase them, they're gonna go to 35, okay? So for you, they're gonna be in number 33 until you buy them, then they're gonna switch to 35, okay? For the black slack boots. Once you guys have that, all you guys want to do now is come over to the um, once you guys saved it, all you want to do now is purchase, I mean, not purchase, show you guys how to make the second one, okay? So I guess what I'm doing is come over to tactical jackets. Put on the khaki tactical blossom. It's the last one on tactical jackets. It's gonna be number 79. Once you guys got that, all you guys want to do now is come over to gun running t-shirts up here. So there you go, gun running t-shirts. And all you want to do is purchase the blue digital rolled T number 22. <coughs> Once you guys got that, all you guys want to do now is come over to the crew emblems. Now guys, if you're not in a crew, you guys can join my second crew, okay? Because this here, the crew, um, the crew emblem will get you the invisible body part okay so if you don't put on the crew emblem you will not get the invisible body okay so yeah so i'm not gonna be showing you guys on how to get the pants and all that because you should already have it from the previous outfit okay so all you guys will do is to save it right on top of the v1 outfit and the final outfit i'm gonna be showing you guys on how to make is this one right here okay so i'm just go ahead and take off the body armor real quick so there you go so all you guys will do now is come over here to the um tops and come over to overcoats okay so overcoats right here there you go, overcoats. And I guess what we do now is purchase the teal open parka number 40. So this is how it looks like. So make sure you purchase this one. And once you guys purchased it, all you guys want to do is come over to the t-shirts. So there you go, t-shirts right here. And all you guys want to do is purchase the feud t-shirt. It's gonna be number 66 right here. And all you guys want to do now once you have purchased it is um come over to the leggings. And all you guys want to do now is come over to the leggings and purchase the gray sparse camo leggings, okay? Once you guys got that, when, all you want to do now is come over to the shoes and put on the deluxe midnight combats, okay? So they're going to be number 24. And once you guys got that, but yeah, also guys, make sure you guys put on the body armor, okay? It's very important to put on the body armor for this outfit, okay? So let's go over to inventory, then body armor and put on the heavy armor, okay? It's the dark, it's the black armor, okay? It's the one I'm wearing right now. So make sure you guys put on the body armor because that you will be needing to merge the CO vest to this outfit, okay? So you'll be needing it. And also guys, once you have saved this outfit, you are done with all the outfits, okay? So this is how they should all look like, so make sure they look like that. Once you guys saved all four outfits, all you guys want to do now is come with the Chica outfit. This is very important, make sure you put on the Chica outfit. It's on outfit standard, okay? Make sure you guys put it on. Once you guys got it, come over to um, your pause menu online and then head over to creator, okay? So once you guys are on creator, all you want to do now is come over to create a race and pick a land race, okay? Now once you guys are on the race, um, the race creator, all you want to do now is come over to title, name it whatever, just spam some random buttons, same as the description, type whatever for the description, and then for the um, photo, just take a random photo also, okay? And then once you guys finish that, come over to maximum players, make it two, and come over and make the route type points to point. 
Now all you want to do is back out and come up to place me. Now once you guys are on the place trigger, all you want to do now is pull up the map and head over to the airport. Once you guys are at the airport, just press A. It's the same button as you're going to place on a waypoint, okay? To teleport over to the airport. So here you go. Now we are at the airport. And all you guys want to do now is place down these triggers, okay? Now take another lobby camera. And once you guys finish, have done that, come over to checkpoints. And all you want to do now is start placing them down. Now you just want to reach the minimum of 0.62 miles, okay? So there we go. Now once you guys have finished the checkpoints, all you want to do now is back out all the way to test. And all you want to do now is just fin do the race. So you go now we finished it all you want to do now is just press ok on this message right here once you guys load in all you want to do now is pull up your pause menu come over to online and do choose character now guys please do not press gta online because if you do you'll mess up the glitch and have to start from step one so guys make sure you go into choose character and not gta online now you guys want to do not delete your female character this is the part i said where you're going to be deleting her later on just come over here and um, press delete and then rocks will make you type out delete so make sure you guys double check you're deleting the right character once you have deleted your female character, all you guys want to do now is back out to story mode, okay? Back out to story mode. So if you're on Xbox, um, it's B, press B on this part. And if you're on PS4, I believe it's square. So yeah, make sure you guys back out to story mode because if you go straight into online, you will mess up the glitch and you're going to load in with zero outfits. And don't be surprised if the glitch did not work for you. So guys, make sure you go into GTA, um, I mean story mode, okay? Now you want to do now is this, now you guys can load into GTA Online. You guys can pick an invite only session or public session. I just picked an invite only session because I'm recording the video. Now that you guys load into the game, um, do not check if the outfits worked for you or anything right now. All you want to do is go over to the nearest colony store and save your current outfit because right now it is not saved. So I'm gonna come over here and save it. And as you guys can see, if you look at the other outfits. They're the same outfits for my female character and they have transferred over, okay? So there we go. Once I come over here, you should see that all the outfits for my female character have transferred over. Now, the only outfit that does show up is the Dragon outfit. These other two do not show up because they need to get merged now, okay? So all you guys want to do now for this is just, um, for the first outfit you guys have to make is the, um, this one right here. I mean, not this one, well, you'll see later on. But all you guys want to do now is just purchase the Deadline, um, which is the Tron outfit, the white Tron outfit. All you guys want to do is just purchase it and then save it right on top of the, um, Tron top outfit, okay? I did tell you guys to, like, um, name the outfits just like mine so you guys won't get confused on this part of the glitch, okay? But you guys want to do is save it right on top of Tron top which is the outfit right on top of Juggernaut, okay? I mean, right under Juggernaut, I meant. Once you guys have saved the Tron outfit right on top of Tron top, all you guys want to do is come over to race um, the rocks are created versus and start Crooked Cop. Now, once you guys are in the race, all you want to do is make come over to clothing and make it player owned, okay? So make this your player owned and then come over to confirm settings and invite someone in. Now guys, if you're not having anyone to join, you guys can just drop your comments down below and just help each other out for this job. So there you go, I got someone in here. Now all you guys want to do, do now when you load in is come over to the outfit that I told you to save, which is the white Tron outfit, so this one right here, and then switch it once to the right to Tron top, okay? So come over to the outfit I told you to save right next to the Tron top, and then sw um, switch it once to the right, and then you should get the outfit merged. And all you guys want to do now is just ready up. We yeah, also guys, I did forget to mention this, uh, make sure you guys have an earpiece okay um if you if you didn't if you don't own an earpiece already you can just back out the job go to any gun store and just purchase an earpiece okay you'll be needing it to save these outfits so come over to style accessories come over to gears and then all you want to do now is purchase an earpiece okay and also guys if you do mess up this part and actually put on a rebreather or night vision mask or something like that just back out the job and you can just redo it again okay so once you guys got the earpiece on, just back out the job, and then now head over to the nearest gun store, which is like right down the street. And all you guys want to do now is save your current outfit, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and save it on Tron Top. So there you go, I just resaved it. And now you guys can delete the Tron outfit that I told you to save earlier, you can just delete it. So now you should have two outfits you have. Right now, you should have the Juggernaut and the Tron Top outfit. Next outfit I'm going to have to make is the Invisible um, outfit, okay? Now this outfit is it's kind of like two outfits, but it's really um one outfit, okay? If you guys want to get multiple outfits, um, I'll show you how to do it later on, okay? So all you guys want to do now is come over to any um clothing store, come over to the pants and put on the black heist pants on utility pants. And all you guys want to do now is come over to the tops, and all you want to do is come over to racing jerseys and put on the downhill motocross number five, okay? So just put this here on, 
Once you guys got it on, all you want to do is save it at the cashier. Now guys, I'm gonna come over here and just save it. Now guys, I recommend for you guys to save it right under Invisible V2. Make sure you guys save it right under Invisible V2, okay? It's very important to save it right under V2. So guys, make sure you guys save it under V2, okay? Now all you guys wanna do is come over to online and start crook to cop again, okay? So start, start up crook to cop. So come over to online, jobs, play job, rocks are created, and then versus, and then crook to cop right here. And all you guys want to do is do the same steps as last time, okay? So just come over here, make it player owned, and then just invite someone else. And I'll cut the video short until I have someone in the job. Now, so all you guys want to do now is come over to own the outfits. And all you guys want to do now is come over to the outfit that I told you to save earlier. And then switch. once you guys are on it, go over to the left once and then go over to the left again, okay? So go from V, switch it once to the left and then you'll be on V2 and then switch it once again and then you'll be on V1, okay? And also guys, if you do want two outfits, all you guys want to do is do the same thing. But this time, um, all you guys want to do now once you guys save this outfit with the earpiece, and then go like say once you guys save this outfit on the store so come over here to the gears put on an earpiece and then back out okay but if you guys want to get five outfits all you guys got to do is just start crooks cop again and all you want to do is just um start crooks cop again and go put the motocross downhill and the black heist pants switch it once to the left to v2 and then now you should have um five modern outfits okay if you want it's your choice okay but all you guys want to do now is just save this outfit i'm gonna just call it invisible so there we go. I hope you guys under uh, understand what I said about la like about the V2. So let's start crook cop again, and then switch it once to V2, and then you should just get the invisible body, okay? Like no, you won't get the arms or anything. Just like full on invisible body, okay? So yeah. Now the final outfit I'm be showing you guys have to make is a CEO vest, okay? Now guys, you'll be needing the CEO vest for today's video. Now guys, if you don't know how to get the CEO vest, I have a link in the description showing you guys how to do it. It's really easy to do. I got the CEO vest in like under five minutes, okay? So here we go, got the CEO vest now. If you don't know how to get it, as I said, it's in the description. Just go ahead in the video down below. Watch it, once you guys have it, come back to this video, okay? Now here you go, got the CEO vest. Now you guys want to do not to save it right on top of the CEO vest outfit, okay? So make sure you guys save it right on top of the CEO vest outfit. Now you guys want to do now is you know what to do. Come over back to Crooked Cop. So here we go, we are on Crooked Cop now. And all you want to do is do the same thing we've been doing, okay? Change it to player owned and then invite someone in. Now all you guys want to do now is do the same thing you've been doing. So just come over to outfit that I told you to save, which is the CO vest. And all you guys want to do is switch it one more time to the right. So come over to outfit that I told you to save, which is the CO vest with like the red top and everything. And then switch it once to the right. And then now you should get the outfit merged. Okay. And all you want to do now is just ready up. And then there you go, you are done. And also, guys, if you need help in any parts of the glitch, you just want to do the same thing we've been doing, just come with style accessories and put on your earpiece, okay? And just back out to drop to your phone. So there we go. We are done with the outfits, okay? And as I said, as I was previously saying, if you guys need any help, just go ahead in the comment section, comment in the comments down below. I'll try my best to help you out. I'll try. I'll, re I'll reply to almost every single comment, okay? Or if I don't see your comment, just DM me on Instagram and see on the watermark right there. And I'll try my best to reply back to you and try, to help, try my best to help you guys out. So yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If the glitch did work for you, I'd appreciate if you drop a like and subscribe and notifications on for more videos like this. Shout out to Money Goods videos and Modern Alpha videos just like this. And yeah, guys, Tom Zine signing out. Peace.